Hi, my name is Steve Irwin and I'm the founder of Franklin Tax Group. I'm here today to show you examples of the components in your real estate that can be depreciated more quickly using cost segregation studies. I may be on site at a restaurant, but the concepts of cost segregation studies apply regardless of the type of commercial real estate or residential apartment complexes that you may own. You're probably depreciating your real estate right now over 39 years. The idea behind a cost segregation study is to go in and identify the components that can be depreciated over 5, 7, or 15 years. By doing this, we're going to speed up your tax deductions, decrease your tax liability, and increase your cash flow, which can then be used to put back into your business to pay off debt or to invest. Now, let's talk about what is a structural component. To understand what structural components are, you need to think about what is necessary for your building to function and be maintained as any type of building in general. You need to have a foundation. You need to have walls, doors, windows, a roof, ceiling, some electrical work, some sanitary sewer lines for your restrooms. Those items are structural components and they are usually depreciated over 39 years. What we want to do is find the personal property assets in your real estate. One way of doing that is something called the business accessory test. This restaurant has crown molding. Now, this crown molding is not something that you need for this to function as a building. It's an accessory to this business. It's more decorative in nature. You'll also notice the lighting in the building. You have to have some form of lighting for it to function as a building. So the lights that you see in the main part of the dining room, the can lights, those would be depreciated as structural components over a longer tax life. But you'll notice the pendant lights hanging above the booths. These are not something that's necessary for this to function as a building. They're an accessory to the business. They're decorative in nature. So that means that the lights, the electrical wiring, the conduit, and in some cases the circuits can be depreciated over a much quicker tax life, usually five or seven years. Now, you will also have different components like this in your real estate that are accessories to your business. You may have decorative woodwork such as base molding, chair rails, crown molding, paneling. You may have cabinetry and countertops, other forms of decorative lighting, carpeting, VCT flooring, vinyl flooring. All of those components can be depreciated over a much quicker tax life. The trick is identifying the cost related to those components. Now I'm going to take you back to the kitchen where I'm going to reveal some hidden secrets about cost segregation studies. Now I'm back in the kitchen where you'll see all this kitchen equipment. Kitchen equipment is personal property, usually depreciated over five or seven years. What you may not know though is there's something called the sole justification test. Basically what that says is that the power and resources supporting all of this personal property equipment can also be depreciated as personal property. So that means all the electrical wiring, the conduit, the receptacles, the plumbing, the valves, those components that you can't see behind the wall can also be depreciated as personal property. Now you may not have kitchen equipment in your building, but you are going to have things like office equipment, computers, medical equipment, manufacturing equipment, appliances. All the components supporting that equipment can be depreciated more quickly using a cost segregation study. The trick again is to discover what the cost of each of those components is. Why don't you follow me now and we'll go outside. Often real estate owners will depreciate their land improvements in with their structural components. What that means is that they're depreciating those land improvements over a much longer tax life than they need to. Land improvements can be depreciated over 15 years. Examples of land improvements outside here are things like asphalt paving, curbs, sidewalks, dumpster enclosures, parking lot lighting, stormwater systems, and the excavation work underneath this parking lot. These components can be depreciated over 15 years. Now that you know some of the examples of components in your real estate that can be depreciated much more quickly, the next step is to contact us. By contacting us, we're going to put together a free estimate of the tax benefits you can expect from a cost segregation study. You can contact us either through the form at the top of our website or by calling the number listed on our website. Thank you.